Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of Chromebook Tips and Tricks video and I'll talk about what is a Chromebook video. I do have a long version of what is a Chromebook video and if you'd like to uh, go beyond uh, today's uh, short version of Chromebook video, you can check that out uh, which I'll provide a link in the description box below. And today I'll go over briefly what is a Chromebook uh, and this is going to be about uh, 10 minutes or below 10 minutes but if you'd like to go beyond that then definitely you can check out the other video link in the description so let's start with what is the chromebook and i do have my index cards here uh, to explain you better so the first thing uh, i'd like to talk about is that uh, chromebook is actually an alternate laptop uh, which doesn't run on windows operating system or apple Apple's Mac operating system. So that's the main difference uh, that you know Chromebook runs on Google's own Chrome OS operating system and that gives some advantages and disadvantages uh, to Chromebook which I'll uh, talk about shortly. So this is uh, our Chromebook is a laptop uh, but you know it's a different type of laptop. Uh, it's comparatively a uh, newer version of laptop. Uh, it's not as old as like uh, Microsoft Windows or Apple uh, Mac OS laptop uh, so there's certain things it can do and there's certain things it cannot do which I'll you know uh, go over briefly as well so think you can think of it a very big version of your Android phone but uh, you know you cannot uh, make calls uh, or you cannot do certain things but definitely you can do most of the things your phone can do you can you know install apps and uh, you know uh, download apps and play with uh, the apps you can uh, download or install from Google Play so that's basic uh, you know that's the basics about Chromebook so now let me just go over some of the advantages of Chromebook which will give you some more idea about you know uh, Chromebook first thing is that uh, Chromebook is very cheap uh, because it is running on uh, Google's operating system it's uh, a lot cheaper than Microsoft uh, or Apple's uh, computers or laptops so for example you can grab a Chromebook from 200 to 300 dollars uh, but you know that's not possible if you are trying to get a Windows or Apple's uh, laptop and Chromebook is a very lightweight laptop uh, it's because of uh, you know its feature it's uh, not as heavy as window or Apple's laptop and then it has a very first uh, fast startup so basically like you know it takes about a couple of seconds or three seconds to start a Chromebook because of the way it's made and then the performance is very fast as well uh, you know it's not it doesn't lag or it doesn't take long to start or turn off like you know, windows and another very good feature of chromebook and is that it is more secured than uh, windows laptop or apple uh, my uh, laptop i'll just touch base on security a little bit later and then uh, chromebook has no annoying updates everything is done in the background so you don't have to like you know uh, wait like windows computers uh, and uh, the computer is not going to freeze or you know leave you in the middle of uh, working like uh, windows and then the battery life is definitely longer uh, because chromebook can run um, you know five hours to ten hours on battery and then you can have all the android app which you see on your phone or most of them you can run on your chromebooks because chromebooks are to run uh, google apps uh, as well so these, these are the basic uh, advantages of Chromebook. So now let's talk about some disadvantages of Chromebook. So the very thing which gives advantages uh, to Chromebook actually is also gives uh, disadvantages to Chromebook. And that, that is that, you know, because this is not run by Windows operating system, you cannot install any Windows software or application. So what it means that you know you're not going to have uh, windows word doc or any video editing software which you would like you know use uh, on your window computer so that's one of the main disadvantages but you can easily bypass you know that disadvantages by um, installing some alternate software from google play and even there are ways you can have you know google uh, sorry windows word doc on your chromebook i do have separate videos on that which you'll find in my chromebook playlist so but in general you cannot uh, run software or application that takes lots of resources like, like you know video editing or photo editing software and in general you cannot have like you know uh, word doc installed on your chromebook 
but uh, you can always use like you know alternate apps from Google Play to edit video or uh, edit photo but that's not going to be exactly same as uh, you are you know uh, working on them on your Windows laptop and another disadvantage is that it has limited storage so Chromebook doesn't need that much storage power due to its you know features so you're not gonna you're not gonna need like you know lots of storage like uh, 80 gig or 150 gig like uh, Windows uh, computer and then another disadvantage is that if you're working from home then uh, you're not gonna be able to run your uh, companies uh, or businesses uh, work from home uh, softwares uh, on Chromebook to work from home but you can definitely uh, you know uh, have uh, remote access on your Chromebook and uh, you can bypass that which uh, on which I have another video at, uh, in my you can find that in my uh, Google Chromebook playlist so these are the main uh, disadvantages of uh, Chromebook now I'm going to touch base a little bit about security but if you'd like to know beyond uh, what I'm talking about today, then definitely check out the other longer version of Chromebook video uh, where I discuss more details about security. So one of the main or one of the ma major uh, reasons Chromebook is so popular because of security feature. And that's the number one is that Chromebook is almost virus proof. Uh, it may not be 100% virus proof, but uh, the virus section or that part is taken care of uh, by Google and you don't need to run any antivirus or firewall or anything on Chromebook because it doesn't need any. Everything is done or taken care of by uh, Google. So that's a very uh, good feature. Uh, so whenever you're using a Chromebook, you can you know work on it worry free. You can use it worry free because you know you don't have to worry about security or you know uh, being stolen or uh, being hacked or any of those because everything is done in the background by Google and uh, Another security feature the reason Chromebook cannot be hacked or cannot be you know uh, Security uh, breached because uh, there is a Thing called sandbox and verified boot. So sandbox is basically uh, each application or each browser or each tab Google keeps it separated and whenever there's a problem or someone try to you know hack it then that gets like you know closed and the virus or the hacker cannot spread onto other parts of uh, Chromebook and even if somehow they get access to that they do then there is a thing called uh, verified boot boot what it does that you know once you reboot your Chromebook or restart your Chromebook it just always compares with the previous uh, good version of uh, Chromebook or Chrome OS and then it just you know ignores or deletes everything if there is a like you know uh, breach or any problem with the previous version so that way you can stay safe and secure with your Chromebook and then the updates are automated uh, you don't have to worry ever about your updates everything is going to happen in the background uh, it's not an, like annoying updates like, like Windows so that's a very uh, good feature and uh, this feature is another reason why lots of people like uh, Chromebook because window up Windows updates are very annoying and you know they keep bothering you when you're working or when you're trying to start your computer and then Chromebooks are in in encrypted uh, what it does that you know uh, if you lose your Chromebook or if someone get access to your Chromebook, they cannot go inside your data or they cannot break into your Chromebook. Your information is safe in your Chromebook, which Windows does not provide, uh, Windows uh, computers does not provide for free. But uh, when you have a Chromebook, it comes with encryption and then, you know, it gives you a peace of mind that uh, uh, unlike uh, Windows computers or laptops, if someone gets hold of your Chromebook, they cannot uh, just, you know, take out information or your data from your Chromebook. So that's another feature which, uh, you know, makes Chromebook unique and a better option than Windows. So that's the very basics about Chromebooks. So like I mentioned before that, you know, this is an operating system which is called Chrome OS, which is uh, very similar like the Chrome browser you have been used to. But it's just like, you know, specialized for uh, Chromebook to run Chromebook. And uh, think of a Chromebook as a uh, bigger tablet or laptop powered by Chrome OS and you can do the same thing like your phone on Chromebook except making the phone call 
or you know doing text messaging but also you can do that if you just you know install uh, appropriate apps you can even like you know make phone calls or do text messaging from your phone book but uh, unlike the phone you cannot uh, just do the network uh, calling or you know calling via your phone uh, network provider on with your Chromebooks except that uh, it has lots of similarities with your phone or Android tablet so that's the basics about Chromebook if you're not happy with uh, what I mentioned about Chromebook so definitely go and check out the longer version of my Chromebook explanation and the link will be in the description box below thank you for watching this video forget about subscribing this channel forget about liking this video there will be more videos coming up so I'll see you shortly thank you